Joining me for our weekly Gab and Ketchup session, I absolutely love this cat. From parts unknown, somewhere in his underground lair, it is Barry Nussbaum. He's a lawyer. He's an international security expert. He knows everything. Barry, what's on your mind today? I have so much for you, Kent. Did That's you it. know? Did you know, Kent, that if there was no news on COVID-19 and it wasn't on TV and there wasn't a lockdown, nobody would know what it was because many, many, many more people are dying from the flu. I'm not done. Kent, did you know that 50% of Americans have either lost their job or have been affected by the economic shutdown, making it the biggest disaster since the 1930s. Kent, did you know that the U.S. government is now saying that the Wuhan Chemical Weapons Biological Weapons Laboratory in Wuhan, China, is probably where the virus came from? Kent, did you know that statistically, your chance from dying from COVID-19 is almost statistically impossible. Did you know that a study by several doctors in California has now concluded that there's virtually a 0.003 chance of dying from COVID-19 in California that has a ton of deaths? Kent, did you know that the denominator that they talk about all the time of the number of deaths from COVID-19 versus the number of infections of COVID-19 may be 50 times higher. In other words, half the country probably has had it or will have it. Kent, did you know that no one is actually tracking the deaths caused as a result of needlessly doc rock locking down the world over COVID-19, meaning the economics and suicide rate and starvation may be killing more people than the disease. And did you know that the US intelligence community is finally investigating where this came from and what we should do about it instead of buying the story from the who? Ken, did you know that US intelligence now believes that 50 times the official Infection and death rate in China may actually be the number of people afflicted. Kent, did you know that a large group, this is not a joke, of guys and gals carrying rifles have marched into the Michigan State Capitol to demand that Governor Whitmer back down on the lockdown on the state of Michigan? 